Hello everyone. This project is about DHDL level humidity sensor and interfacing it with Arduino. In this project, we are going to use DHDL level sensor and Arduino. Before going into the project, let's know briefly about DHDL level. DHDL level is a digital temperature and humidity sensor that contains calibrated sig digital signal output of temperature and humidity is it is connected with a high performance 8 bit microcontroller and it has three pins vcc ground and data its humidity measurement range is 20 to 90 percent RH. Temperature measurement range is 0 to 60 degrees Celsius. Output digital signals indicating temperature and humidity. Temperature measurement accuracy is plus or minus 2 degrees Celsius. Humidity measurement accuracy is plus or minus 5 percent RH. It works at voltage of 5 volts. It is reliable, cheap and long term has long term stability. There is also DH22 which is more expensive version of the same DHT11 with a better humidity ranging, measuring ranging from 0 to 100 percent with 2 to 5 percent accuracy. While, it, while the DHT11 has 20 to 80 percent with 5 percent accuracy. DHT22 can measure from minus 40 to 125 degrees Celsius with 0.5 degrees Celsius as accuracy and its operating voltage is same as DHT11 that is 3 to 5 volts and maximum current during measuring is also same as DHT11 that is 2.5 milliamps. Coming to the hardware circuit. DHT11 has three pins VCC ground and data pin. VCC of DHT11 is connected to 5 volts of Arduino pin using the red jumper wire, and ground is connected to Arduino ground pin with black jumper wire, and data terminal is connected to two second pin that is digital second pin of Arduino board using blue jumper wire. Coming to hardware connections, there are three pins, VCC, data and ground from right to left. VCC is connected using green wire and it's connected to 5 volts of Arduino board and ground is connected to ground of DHT11 sensor and data is the middle terminal let me show you yeah data is middle terminal which is connected through brown jumper wire to second pin of the Arduino board. These are the hardware connections and coming to the working I am going to connect Arduino board to my PC. Now I am going to dump my code to my Arduino board. The code is successfully dumped without any errors and I opened my serial monitor which is showing humidity in my room which is 57. If I blow, if I blow air around the sensor, the humidity increases because of my uh, blow humidity
and the value I'm blowing it now and the value goes to 62 and I am I stopped it then the value is gradually decreasing Coming to the code, we have to include DHT library. Uh, to include this, go to sketch, include library, manage libraries, search for DHT library. And install DHT sensor library by Adafruit it includes DHT11, DHT22 etc temperature and humidity I have already installed it and I included DHT library uh, and then I am using second pin of Arduino board so I am defining DHT pin with 2 and I am using DHT11 so my DHT type will be DHT11 if you are using 22 you can change it to 22 and coming to the next step I am sending a parameters as DHT pin and DHT type coming to setup I am beginning the DHT it will go to the loop with for every 2 seconds of delay the values are calibrated the main function in this is read humidity it is same like read temperature read humidity is a function which uh, takes the value from the data pin and stores it in the float type of integer so a variable float type of variable here it is h in the next step I am checking whether the H is an in number or not using is nan where nan is nothing but not a number uh, if it is not a number then it is true and we get fail to read from DHT sensor in the serial monitor and then it returns out of the loop the loop will be broken and next I am going to print serial print dot print and I will be printing humidity of variable h and this is the extra part if you can use it you can use it it, it is it calculates the heat index in your room compute heat index function will uh, calibrate your heat index here f will be the uh, temperature in Fahrenheit and the heat index will be in the Fahrenheit which will be stored in HIF and compute here in this case it will be in Celsius and I'm going to remove this part it's the extra part and this too this is project about uh, humidity so I'm removing the heat index part which you can also use and that's it you can find this code in the description this is my project thank you